Well, when it comes to art, whether you prefer the abstract to the traditional or chaos to order, you'll find a little bit of all that in the work of artist Elise Wagner. She's here with us this morning to talk about a new exhibit right here in Tulsa. How are you? Welcome to Very Tulsa. Good. Thank you. It's great to be here. Will you do what is called uh, encaustic painting? Explain what that is to everyone. Uh, encaustic painting is an ancient medium that dates back to Greek times and it was uh, used on Greek warships and then later Greeks that settled in Egypt began using it uh, to, uh, for their funerary customs and mm -hmm. it's basically beeswax combined with resin and pigment and in ancient times they used more uh, natural pigments and now you can use synthetic and all different other kinds of pigments and you paint it on with a brush. When like, I was trying to learn about it online they also call it hot wax painting. Yes. Okay, because yeah. it's kind of in a solid form you said? Right, right. And you make your own paint yes, to paint, correct? I do. I make my own line of encaustic colors and uh, you basically they come in a can and you mm -hmm. melt them on a hot plate and uh, you use a brush and you brush them on and then you have to fuse it to the surface with an additional heat like from a heat gun or a blowtorch or mm -hmm. something like that. So, so there's definitely more processes into just yeah, traditional painting. Yeah, there's an enormous amount of process involved with it. Yeah. Like how long did it take you to put this one together for example? Um, that took a couple weeks but generally you know that's kind of a, a tough question because I've been at this for two decades so mm -hmm. I kind of tend to uh, think that everything I've done is, is, has taken as long as I've been doing it for. So, <laughs> <laughs> Why did you decide to call the exhibit 50 Gestures? Uh, because these were done in a, a very uh, improvised fashion, uh, very Im improvisational. Uh, I didn't spend very much time fussing over them. They happened very quickly and I just was kind of going on my instincts with them. So uh, they're kind of an embodiment of, of all the methods and approaches I've taken over the years. That's so funny that's that why, you say yeah. that since this particular kind of painting has so many processes and, right. and is so lengthy. Yeah, and, and, and the 50 gestures, there's, there's part of every single method I've used in every single one of those paintings. So, How would you describe your work, if you could, in a wrap-up? Um, I suppose it would be abstract and uh, celestial and relating to science and meteorology and all of the kind of, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I that guess that sounds good to me. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, just just that it it's, it, it, it it kind of is a reflection of the world around us and mm -hmm. how I interpret it. Okay. And let's uh, get the information up there for Elise Wagner's exhibit. Again, it's called 50 Gestures. It opened last night at Aberson Exhibits and will show through March 6th. They are right here on Brookside at 36th and Peoria. For more information, go to abersonexhibits.com. Thanks so much. Thank you. Back to you, Justin.